Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Amen. Most Holy Trinity, Father, Son, and Holy Ghost, I adore thee profoundly. I offer thee the most precious body and blood, soul, and divinity of Jesus Christ present in all the tabernacles of the world in reparation for the outrages, sacrileges, and indifferences by which he is offended, and through the infinite merits of his most sacred heart and of the Immaculate Heart of Mary, I beg of thee the conversion of poor sinners. Amen. My God, I believe, I adore, I hope, and I love thee. I beg pardon for those who do not believe, do not adore, do not hope, and do not love thee. My God, I believe, I adore, I hope, and I love thee. I beg pardon for those who do not believe, do not adore, do not hope, and do not love thee. My God, I believe, I adore, I hope, and I love thee. I beg pardon for those who do not believe, do not adore, do not hope, and do not love thee. Sancti Michael Arcangeli, defendi nos in prerio, contra nequitiam et insidias diaboli est opresidium, imperatidi Deus supicesta precamua, tuque princeps venitiae celestis, satana mariosque spiritus manignos, quel perditionem animarum propagantur in mundo, divine virtute in infirm de trude. Amen. Our Lady of the Rosary, pray for us. As we enter into these joyful mysteries, it's a great joy to be praying with you here from the heart of Ave Philomena, the heart of St. Philomena, rather. The heart of St. Philomena, these 160 acres dedicated to our Lord and Our Lady. And so I'm praying from the midst of the construction site here in where our Lord will very soon, we hope, we pray, be taking up his residence right there in what will become the sanctuary before me. And I'll be saying, uh, I'll ask you, please, if at all possible, to stay a few minutes extra at the end for me to make some important announcements. If you can now, please take a sheet of paper. If you have a sheet of paper anywhere nearby and a pen, please go ahead and grab those. And the two simple prayers we're gonna to add to the rosary throughout these nine days to make it very, very simple are Saint Philomena pray for us and Saint Joseph pray for us, those two prayers. And so let's pray these joyful mysteries asking Our Lady to obtain all that's necessary for this project to come to completion, and even more for the spiritual work, which I'll be speaking about at the end of this rosary, to be fulfilled in abundance. Saint Philomena, pray for us. Saint Joseph, pray for us. Saint Joseph, terror of demons, cast thy solemn gaze upon the devil and all his minions, and protect us with thy mighty staff. Thou fled through the night to avoid the devil's wicked designs. Now, with the power of God, smite the demons as they flee from thee. Grant special protection, we pray, for children, fathers, mothers, families, and the dying. By God's grace, no demon dares approach while thou art near. So we beg of thee, St. Joseph, always be near to us. Amen. St. Joseph, the terror of demons, pray for us. Eternal Father, we offer thee the most precious blood of thy divine Son, Jesus, in union with the Masses said throughout the world today, for all the holy souls in purgatory, for sinners everywhere, for sinners in the universal church, those in my own home and within my family. Amen.
the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Ghost, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. The third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From thence he shall come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Ghost, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. The first joyful mystery, the Annunciation to the Blessed Virgin Mary. We ask for the fruit of the mystery, an increase of humility. Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, 
and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The second joyful mystery, the visitation. We ask for the fruit of the mystery, fraternal charity. Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thine mercy. The third joyful mystery, the birth of our Savior at Bethlehem, we ask for the fruit of the mystery, a spirit of poverty. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thine mercy. The fourth joyful mystery, the presentation of the child Jesus in the temple. We ask for the fruit of the mystery, a spirit of obedience and purity. Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, 
now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thine mercy. The fifth joyful mystery, the finding of the child Jesus in the temple. We ask for the fruit of the mystery, an increase of love for our divine Savior. Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thine mercy. 
O Jesus, I choose to live this day for love of Thee, for the conversion of sinners, and reparation for the sins committed against the Immaculate Heart of Mary. Amen. Ave Regina Celorum, Ave Domina Angelorum, Salve Radix, Salve Porta, Ex qua mundo lux est torta, Gaude Virgo Glorigosa, Super Omnes Specigosa, Vale go valde decora, e pro nobis Christum ex ora. Digna de me laudare te Virgo Sacrata, dami qui virtutem contra hostes tuos. Let us pray. Grant unto us, O merciful God, a defense against our weakness that we who remember the Holy Mother of God, by the help of her intercession, may rise from our iniquities through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. And may Almighty God, through the intercession of the Immaculate Heart of the Blessed Virgin Mary, pour His graces upon each one of your families, benedictio Deum Dipotentis, Patris et Filii Spiritus Sancti, descendat super vos et maniat semper. Amen. Today is the first day of our nine days of prayer and nine days of, of begging for you to become St. Philomena's co-worker. Would you be willing to become one of St. Philomena's co-workers? In just a moment, you're going to see a special video we've prepared to tell you what that is, to invite you to become officially one of St. Philomena's co-workers. And each of these nine days, I want to speak about one aspect of what it means spiritually to become one of St. Philomena's co-workers. And I'll say also a few words about this chapel which we're trying to complete, and uh, it would be hard for me to underestimate, to overestimate, how important you are. Uh, if you can believe it, everything that's happened so far is because of your generosity, and we're at a really key point, which I'll mention in a moment. But take a look down towards where the altar is going to be. I'm going to step out of the way for a moment, and you can see these two niches. The niches are going to have beautiful statues of angels. There'll be a 19-foot high altar, a uh, hand carved that will be in the middle of it. But those two, picture those two niches there, those two, picture a statue of our Lord in the Blessed Sacrament and a statue of Our Lady. Don Bosco once had a vision of the church in terrible times. The church is a ship that was being buffeted every which way by storms, was risking uh, shipwreck, and was saved by anchoring the ship to the one pillar of our Lord in the Blessed Sacrament and the other pillar of Our Lady. That is the goal of everything here, of St. Philomena, of the Our Lady of Fatima Rosary Crusade, of Regina Angelorum Press, of Ave Philomena. The goal, if you want to become one of St. Philomena's co-workers, is to anchor your own soul, your family's souls, and help souls throughout the world be anchored to the Blessed Sacrament, Jesus and the Blessed Sacrament, and Our Lady. Because if souls can really open to our Lord Jesus Christ and the Blessed Sacrament and to Our Lady, there's nothing that they can't do. And so that's the great goal. I felt that in my priesthood from many years ago, that, that what I'm called to do is help people come to know and love Jesus, especially in the Blessed Sacrament, and Our Lady, so that they can act powerfully in their lives. And then St. Philomena. So why St. Philomena? Above all, I believe that that's who God has chosen for us. That's the, among all the workers in heaven, I really believe, and that would be too long of a story to go into, I believe that God has chosen St. Philomena for that role, to be, as it were, the, the, the chief worker, the architect who's leading the charge for all of this work. And to mention just one reason right now, God chose her to be a great miracle worker especially on behalf of priests. And in the midst of the crisis today, the, holy, the sacred priesthood, the Catholic priesthood, the priesthood of Jesus Christ is extremely under attack. And St. Philomena was instrumental in, above all, the Curia of Ars, and also in the holy parish priest in Mugnano, where her relics were first taken in Italy. She was instrumental in them becoming holy priests, in miracles being poured out, and in thousands, tens of thousands, uh, millions, really, 
of conversions flowing through her intercession. And so I'm going to stop there for today. I'm going to talk more. But remember those two pillars of the Blessed Sacrament and Our Lady, and then St. Philomena's role. That's the, the first part of the teaching and wanting to, wanting to help make that happen if you want to be one of St. Philomena's co-workers. Now, the last thing I'll say before the video plays is if you have that sheet of paper I mentioned at the beginning, and if not, take out a sheet of paper. And if you haven't done so, right at the top, St. Philomena, pray for us. St. Joseph, pray for us. And I'm going to ask you now to write two other things on that sheet of paper. Think for a moment, during these next nine days, what is a number, an uncomfortable number, that you might be able to give to help this chapel be completed? Now, the reason I'm asking that is, think of, here in the United States at least, there were many, many poor families who came as immigrants to the United States, and, and they built these beautiful, really beautiful parish churches. And they did that by making great sacrifices. And so think for a moment, I'm not asking you to, to, to do this or decide to do this today, but consider writing down a number and then praying on it. Think about, all of us have unexpected things that happen. We, um, the car breaks down, have to fix it, or someone gets sick, we have unexpected medical bills, or uh, a number, any one of a number of things happen. And when we have to, we find a way to pay for something extra, to give something extra. So consider it in that light, please. And again, pray on it. And if you feel God's not calling you to do so, then so be it. But write down a number that is a, an uncomfortable number. What would be a real sacrifice, but something that you, you might be able to give during these next nine days. And then the second number is write down a number, again, uncomfortable, that would be a sacrifice of what you might be able to give on a monthly basis throughout this next year. And I'm not asking you to, to do anything further, and I'm really, in the spirit of Don Bosco, he, very, very holy saint, which I'm not, unfortunately, but he was quite, um, quite wily. He would, he would fundraise and ask, he would beg, he would beg often, and so I'm, I'm begging today. I'm begging to write down those two numbers, what you could give maybe uncomfortably, but might be possible during these next nine days, and what, again, uncomfortably, but with sacrifice, you might be able to give once a month for the next year. Pray on that for a couple of days, and then, and then do what you think God is calling you to do. And you're, um, you're going to see right now the video we've prepared. So God bless you. I'll look forward to praying the Holy Rosary with you tomorrow. Would you be willing to help St. Philomena, one of the greatest miracle workers of the past 200 years, to help souls from all over the world come to know and love Jesus and Mary by becoming one of St. Philomena's co-workers, so that our Lord Jesus Christ and Our Lady might act much more powerfully in hearts and souls in a world which is so in need of their presence. St. John Bosco once had a vision where the church would be in terrible times, risking to indeed shipwreck the entire church, but that the church would be fastened and held safe by two pillars. On top of one pillar was Our Lady, Queen of Heaven and Earth, Queen of Angels. On top of the other pillar was Our Lord in the Blessed Sacrament, and by anchoring the church to those two pillars, the church was protected and safe. The most essential thing in the world is the holy sacrifice of the Mass and the adoration of our Lord. Padre Pio used to say that the world could more easily exist without the Son than it could without the Mass. And so we feel that God has asked us to create a place called St. Philomena, where the adoration and worship of God will be central. These beautiful 160 acres here in Kansas, dedicated to our Lord and Our Lady, in the heart of which will be the Holy House of Loreto Chapel, where our Lord will take up his dwelling in the Blessed Sacrament, 
and where the holy sacrifice of the Mass will be offered and where he will be adored throughout the day. It will become the home for Our Lady of Fatima Rosary Crusade and one day we hope that you will be able also to visit and to have this place help you to open your souls more fully to the grace of God. God has been known to ask St. Philomena to play a crucial role in places where the church is falling apart, not physically, but spiritually. The Curie de Ars, St. John Marie Vianney, in France, was once sent by his bishop to a parish that was in great spiritual need. The bishop told him it was lacking in love for God. So the Curie de Ars called upon little St. Philomena to assist him, and she became the great miracle worker in that place, playing a key role in transforming the parish into one of the holiest parishes, where people would come from far and wide to have their spiritual lives renewed and for sinners to be converted. Ave Philomena desires to cooperate with God in helping our Lord and Our Lady to act powerfully in our work today. We believe that God has chosen Saint Philomena as the key worker in heaven who wants to lead this project. We are inviting you today to become Saint Philomena's co-workers, to choose to do something very important with Saint Philomena. And so what is the work of Ave Philomena? It is to help anchor souls throughout the world to these two pillars. Through Our Lady, by every single day, uniting souls from countries throughout the world in the prayer of the Rosary. From Pakistan to Israel, to Singapore to South Africa, to Indonesia to India, to Germany to Holland, to Romania, to countries all over the world the young and the old, from families gathering to those who feel alone, from those who are in the midst of their workplace to those who are sick or in hospital. We gather every day in the Our Lady of Fatima Rosary Crusade to come before Our Lady with whom all things are possible. In addition to that, there are many other programs we want to develop. We've received permission from a number of publishers to turn good classic works on the spiritual life into programs that can be available with video content for people throughout the world. We can't accomplish this without you. In fact, though it may be hard for you to believe, everything that has been achieved so far materially has been accomplished because of you. It's been through many donations from all over the world that have allowed us to begin the St. Philomena project. And now we appeal to you again for your prayers and your generous contributions for us to be able to bring the project to its full fruition. To become one of St. Philomena's co-workers, we would ask these three things of you. Firstly, Commit to praying daily the short prayer, Saint Philomena, pray for us. Secondly, to pray five decades of the rosary daily. And thirdly, that you earnestly consider making a $25 monthly contribution to Ave Philomena. A monthly mass on first Fridays will be offered for the co-workers of Saint Philomena. Anyone who is unable to contribute monetarily at this time is encouraged to let us know in writing to our mailing address listed on the Ave Philomena website that they wish to become co-workers by offering their personal sacrifices and prayers in support of the work of St. Philomena. Those who write to us will then be included in the monthly Mass offered by Father Pilari. We now leave this in God's hands. May his will be done. Our Lady of Fatima, pray for us. Saint Philomena, pray for us.